The world is full of good news. The following are just a few. Foreign ministry delegates from Russia and Japan affirmed their country's willingness to continue diplomatic negotiations over a long-standing territory issue involving four islands to achieve peaceful resolution. British construction equipment manufacturing company JCB Sales Limited donates two backhoe loaders along with accessories to help with Pakistan's post-flood relief efforts. Award-winning Hollywood actor and film producer Leonardo DiCaprio launches the International Fund for Animal Welfare's annual Animal Action Week with a special focus this year on preserving tigers from extinction. A UK-based agricultural business withdraws from plans to open an 8,100 cow dairy in Lincolnshire, UK after public concerns regarding animal welfare and environmental pollution were raised. Thailand's border military pledges to work toward enhanced relations with Cambodia, announcing that a special session of the Regional Border Committee has been scheduled. The 33rd International Book Fair is held in Montevideo, Uruguay, with over 60 exhibits from international publishing houses amidst a colourful programme that includes roundtable discussions and the launching of several books. A team of European Union experts are arriving in Hungary to offer their assistance in containing the effects of a recent toxic spill. Model and former Miss Panama Patricia de Leon appears in new ad by animal welfare organisation People for the Ethical Treatment of Animals, or PETA, calling for an end to the inhumane and cruel practice of bullfighting. To help preserve the advancement of Israeli and Palestinian peace talks, United Nations Secretary General Ban Ki-moon calls on Israel to restore her moratorium on construction in the Palestinian West Bank. The Grow Food, Grow Hope project initiated at Wilmington College in Ohio, USA provides 40 plots of land for less fortunate local families who supplement their nutrition and reap the rewards of success by growing abundant fresh vegetables and herbs.